my students are very young, so uh, you should have, uh, you, you must have a positive uh, attitude for them. Um, the most important is to make them feel that they can act. As I'm a computer science teacher, uh, we are doing a lot of experiments. We are doing outdoor experiments yeah. also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and I uh, try to make them observe the nature. My students were, are older than uh, them, from 15 to 18, so they are a young citizen. And uh, my, in my opinion, the best could be um, work with the stakeholder around the, uh, around the, the school. We have, we have also created a little group of uh, uh, junior activists. They are in, in charge at school level to organize some activities, recycling activities, cleaning activities. When the other students see this group of students doing something, uh, planting uh, watering or experiments uh, in my classroom, they are also motivated to do the same. Teaching ex uh, climate change is not only focused on the effect of climate change, the negative effect on, on climate change, but also try to solve and try to offer to the students a possibilities. It's very important to be positive because otherwise... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Otherwise the students can be... Uh, and they are Boy. really stressed for so many things from their family, from the economy, from, yeah. the, from the news, from everything. When uh, parents, uh, community and uh, NGO are uh, collaborating with schools, I think that's uh, oh. the, the best uh, uh, path to take for uh, helping the children um, tackle climate change at the end. Oh. But they have to feel it. It's important also to give them a, a perspective mm -hmm. for the careers, for a STEM career to do a, a something uh, for the citizenship related to this uh, topic. <laughs>